Have you ever accepted something that you had to walk away from? Accepted something that I had to walk... Yeah. Oh, yeah. I was supposed to do... I guess I could say... Yeah, this is fine. I was supposed to do Euphoria. I was supposed to be that uh, uh, ashtray on Euphoria. Oh, And what? I didn't do it because I did Shazam. Oh. And I'm so glad about that. I'm so glad... Because he died. Or doesn't he die? I think so, yeah. yeah so I don't want it. <laughs> <laughs> Freddie Freeman will never die. Uh. If he dies, dude, I'll be pissed. If Freddie Freeman dies, then then I'll be like, Fuck, I'll do it for you. <laughs> no. Then I'll regret everything. There's something to Shazam that is like, you can't. I love it. And I always wanted to be in the DC universe also. Like, I loved Batman. Batman was my favorite dude on planet Earth. And I wanted to do, I wanted to be in DC. To be honest, like Shazam, Luca, those are forever things. Yeah. That last, bro, when That's we true. are gone and our grand, like our grandkids, our grandkids, grandkids, they will still enjoy these movies. That's a great thing. Is that fucking wild to think about? Yeah. That 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 is like that's mind melting. I don't understand. The, uh, wow. Yeah, that's cool. That that's the best part about it. One of the best parts about it about making movies. I just read I so I I've been done going down that Babylon uh rabbit hole. Which by the way, it's like about 1920s Hollywood, right? Yes, and I just read the book Hollywood Babylon, which if you haven't read it, it's so freaky. There's so much freaky. Sh but also, it was golden and people were like, we're doing something. We're making movies. We're making movies. We're, we're making dreams become physical. Physical like we're we're making the dreams that we have in our sleep uh, like real, you know, physical things. And I was like, that's so powerful. That's so like the the principle of making a movie is so it must make you emotional. It gives me chills. Like that's why I love movies. It's just mo like I just I don't know. It's so heavy. It's so decadent. It's much bigger than any one person or collection of people. Yeah, I mean books too, but but there's something about movies that that will stay in the timeline of or or, or, or the or the the this the what do you call it like the you know what I'm talking about? Is it the zeitgeist? Yeah, zeitgeist is good. Zeitgeist like the zeitgeist of our history historic timeline. They're just there. They're implanted there, and they're still there, and they're stuck there. Do you, you can watch them whenever. 